Welcome to an overview of TopView and Skata Connect. The purpose of this video is to introduce users to Skata Connect so you can understand the purpose and function of this TopView feature. We'll start with an overview of the main TopView components so you can see where Skata Connect fits into the overall product offering. Skata Connect is primarily a TopView configuration tool, so we'll first take a look at how users configure TopView without Skata Connect. We'll then describe what Skata Connect is, how you launch it, and the main task that you'll execute when using Skata Connect. TopView consists of multiple components that work together. The TopView engine is the real-time alarm and notification engine. There may be multiple engines running on the same machine, each monitoring different points and sending notifications based on different TopView configurations. Our clients allow users to monitor tag values, alarms, and alarm history and can provide user actions such as alarm acknowledge, alarm disable, and shelving. TopView admin tools is used to manage the running TopView engines. It provides access to performance information, notification queues, connected client details, as well as all application, alarm, and notification logs. There are two primary applications for configuration of the TopView engines. The TopView configurator is the primary configuration tool. This desktop application allows the user to configure the tasks for each instance of the TopView engine, including the points or tags to monitor, alarm limits, and notification settings. The Web Configurator is a web-based version of the desktop configurator and can run local or remote to the TopView machine. SCADA Connect works with the desktop configurator to aid in the configuration of SCADA alarms. Although many SCADA users will only run one instance of the TopView engine, we allow users to run multiple runtime engines. Each engine is a separate process. Larger installations may want to group their alarms into smaller sets, and therefore separate engine processes that run independently of one another. Each engine is controlled by a configuration that defines the alarms and notifications that the engine is responsible for. This configuration can be viewed and edited in both the desktop configurator and the web configurator. The user sees this configuration as a single file with a .cfg extension, although under the hood there are multiple files involved in the storage of the configuration settings. All versions of TopView allow the user to manually configure TopView without SCADA Connect. The typical configuration tasks include configuring the connection to the data server, defining the list of tags that should be monitored. For each monitored tag, the user then configures the alarm condition. For an existing alarm, the monitored tag may be a Boolean that is true when the alarm is active. If alarm acknowledge is available in the monitored system, and if the user would like to synchronize the acknowledge state between TopView and the monitored system, the user needs to configure the acknowledge tags. Then the user needs to configure the other properties of the tags, such as description, areas or groups, and the alarm message. The configurator does not require the user to individually configure each alarm. Bulk tag configuration is available through CSV files to reduce the configuration time. But even with these tools, the user still needs to provide the tag properties. Many SCADA customers used TopView without SCADA Connect before it was available, and may currently use TopView with systems not supported by SCADA Connect. So although manual configuration is possible, there are challenges for SCADA customers. First, the user must configure the gateway used to access the data server. The gateway is typically the OPC server for the SCADA, although some SCADAs have multiple OPC servers or may require the user to perform configuration steps before clients like TopView can connect. Although tag browsing usually exists, many SCADAs do not expose the full alarm tag name with the correct extension or property required by TopView. Based on the data type of the alarm tag, the alarm condition must be configured correctly. For example, Boolean alarm tags will have an alarm condition of equals true, while some SCADAs require monitoring for a set of values or a specific bit of an integer value. For bidirectional acknowledge, the correct acknowledge tag names and acknowledge values need to be configured. Additional tag properties, like alarm description, priority, and group must be imported. Optional health monitoring SCADA outputs also need to be configured. 
Before SCADA Connect, some TopView integrators created tools to convert SCADA alarm configurations to TopView configurations. While these tools were beneficial to their customers, they were not available to all TopView customers. We created SCADA Connect as the tool that all customers could use. SCADA Connect simplifies TopView configuration for SCADA users. It assists with the configuration of the gateway, imports existing alarm tags with correct names, configures the alarm conditions and acknowledge tags, imports additional tag properties and alarm messages, and includes example health monitoring outputs. For some SCADAs, it also includes example HMI components and scripts for TopView health monitoring and application access. Starting with version 635, SCADA Connect is installed with TopView. For earlier versions, the TopView download page contains links to download and install SCADA Connect. In TopView 635 and earlier, SCADA Connect runs as a separate application. Because SCADA Connect may make configuration changes to TopView, we recommend closing the configurator while using SCADA Connect. SCADA Connect will retrieve the SCADA alarm information and either create a new TopView configuration or add tags to an existing configuration. Once it completes, the user can open the updated configuration in the configurator. In TopView 636 and later, the user can run SCADA Connect without leaving the configurator. They can choose to add SCADA alarms to the existing configuration or to create a new configuration based on templates for each SCADA. The retrieved alarms are then imported into the configuration. The first task for the SCADA Connect user is to configure the gateway. This involves the configuration of the gateway server in TopView and may, depending on the SCADA, involve configuration steps of the gateway itself. Most users will only perform this step once. Once the gateway is configured, HMI Sync will be used to import alarms from the SCADA to a TopView configuration. Each SCADA alarm database is accessed in a specific way. Depending on the SCADA, this may be a direct connection to the SCADA runtime, accessing the SCADA alarm database or project, or a tag database dump file, which is usually a CSV. After selecting the desired import options, the user will be presented with a list of discovered SCADA alarms. After selecting the desired alarms for import, SCADA Connect will import these alarms into the TopView configuration.